With COVID-19 cases on the decline here in Yellowstone County and the new governor indicating an eventual repeal of the state's mask mandate, Billings parents and students are wondering what that means for next fall. Well, School District 2 Superintendent Greg Upham says today there's too much unknown. Q2's Mitch Leggy brings us more. This school year has been a challenge for both students and parents, with new schedules, masking requirements, and distance learning. In a Facebook Live update video today, Billings School District 2 Superintendent Greg Upham said he's looking to start next school year as normal as possible, but the state of COVID-19 in the community will define what normal will look like. Upham said he's watching the distribution of the vaccine, case numbers in the community, and waiting to learn how much additional federal money the district will receive. Upham said we can only watch and wait on the virus, but he had a phone conversation with Senator John Tester a few days back and wrote to Senator Steve Daines to share his on-the-ground experience. Upham told the senators that the additional cost to the district to operate remote and live instruction this year was $5 million, and that's the amount it would take to offer a similarly robust program next year. Um, I won't know until we see the level of funding that's available to us um, and also looking at the status of the virus. I can tell you that um, live instruction is what we're, we will offer, obviously, um, and the extent of a remote instruction is yet to be determined. I'm not saying we're not, and I'm not saying we are. I just need to see what those variables are. Upham said that he expects to learn sometime this week how much federal money the district will receive. And when it comes to masking students, Upham said he's taking cues from the Centers for Disease Control and local health experts. Even if Governor Greg Gianforte lifts the statewide mask mandate, he expects the students to remain masked for the remainder of this year. Reporting in Billings, Mitch Laggy, MTN News. All right, thanks so much, Mitch. Now, Upham also urged Billings parents with incoming kindergartners to register their students early. The first day to register your kindergarten kindergartners is February 1st.